The Jinx Planning Commission voted tonight to approve a downtown rezoning ordinance that would go before the City Council now for a final vote. News on Six's Ashland Brothers is live in Jinx with what this means for the city and why some business owners were so against it. Ashland? Well, Lori, the commission addressed a very concerned and quite angry crowd here tonight full of Jinx residents and business owners. Now, if approved by the city council, then that would mean the ordinance would bring many changes to the city of Jinx. The commission says the goal is to make Jinx more competitive with surrounding cities, preserve the city's historical value, attract more tourists, and improve residents' quality of life. The city says changes along Main Street are intended to make five additional blocks feel like historic downtown Jinx by implementing codes that fit with the aesthetic. The city says the properties can be grandfathered in and become non-conforming. However, owners would not be able to expand their property to make it more non-conforming. The overlay district is designed to make residents' properties multifunctional, and the riverfront district focuses on entertainment, tourism, and walking accessibility. But many property owners worry that these restrictions will impact their resale value as well as limit their there were uses and ability to make changes and expand. The city says while the ordinance would be the law, the plan isn't completely rigid and they're open to any idea that could truly enhance the Jinx experience. So they're imposing their will on property owners who should be able to develop orderly and with quality what they wanted to develop in Jinx. Value our residents, we value our citizens, the businesses that are here, the businesses that are coming, and I've stated it before, I very sincerely mean it. Just because the UDO is adopted doesn't mean there aren't other tools. And the ordinance will go to city council for vote early next month. Live in Jinx, Ashland Brothers, Oklahoma Zone, News on 6.